Hello YouTube, today we're doing Greg's Halloween Cakes. Yes. First Greg's thing we've done. <laughs> yes. First. This was out from Greg's, so say, um, for the Halloween stuff. And there was a uh, four for £2.15. Four, four, um, £2 so have one of each, one, <laughs> one each flavour. I think it'll be any different flavours. Well, we'll get that one, that'll be better. Well, not the same, different flavour. The icing's a bit different colour. So, which one do you want? Oh, I've orange one, I'll try for. Got a plastic thing on the top, but it's not really fair at all. No, just like a bit of something you can build on Minecraft. Mm. It'll be alright, something to stick in our drawer to clog up the drawers. I want to give away one day. Yeah. We get famous enough. Yeah. Well, there's lots of stuff I've thrown away recently. What could have been famous? Mm. Just click there, nothing, nothing's best in the middle. Just like a quake. <laughs> quake. It's a nice soft sponge. Better than my mum can cook. When she cooks, she makes nice cakes when she yeah. does them. Bland cakes, no. <laughs> well, you got the sugary stuff on the top. Icing. Nice. Icing. Nice. Right. Nice. Gives it a decision taste. Mmm. The fuzzy ones are the ones that get eaten. Mmm. You have one. Mmm. You have a cake, you want another one? Yeah, because you know what's going to happen if we don't eat them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that one little thing. I've got a. How's your Osborne's favourite thing to eat? A bat. If you didn't know what that was, you must be stupid. Yeah. I think they've been doing in the summer next year. They're doing ants ones shaped to the ant. What's in this? I don't know. This is just um, a gingerbread man, but no, it's, it's is it ginger bat? Bread, I think. No, it isn't a gingerbread. Is it ginger? Ginger, it is. Oh God! Oh, it's like this is do a. It used to be a what? Should we call it? A jog. A hedgehog, yeah. You, you have it. I was doing a recipe um, last week with a chef what does gingerbread men and adds in the recipe mustard powder Why? to give it that more a bit more hotness oh. so just putting loads of ginger in <laughs> so give you a tip put some mustard it's quite hot mustard is <laughs> That's something more joke we know about. Yeah, it's really hot. Yeah, what it is hot. It's a spawn of Satan or something like that. Because it's not meant to be hot. These are not hot. No. Some are from ginger skin colour. Mmm. I think ginger is raw form. Mm. I used to take um ginger um it was gin dry ginger, but it was just and what was stem ginger was sugar in and I was taking them for a bit because I was yes I'll tell you I lost I lost a lot of weight once and I was down to really really skinny but it made me really ill everywhere I went with uh, to do with say fried food or chips and stuff like that it used to make me feel sick so I asked in the sweet shop if there's anything you could have for being sick and she said Try stem ginger. Yeah. And it settles your stomach and it really did work. And I. Are you going to eat more of that? Which one, the cake? The biscuit. You can have it. Nice, that is. Yeah, I quite like it, but I don't fancy it at the moment. You can't quite so I used to have um, the stem ginger for that. I went to the pub with our friend once on this because we used to go on holiday a lot. We don't do it no more. Uh, I was in the pub and I seen me running it back out the pub quick as I could. It was a lot longer just been outside where there's a chip shop. Smelt that, went back into the pub, run out, and they thought one of the member of staffs thought, because I was drinking, thought I was, you know, drank a lot to be sick. I said, no, it's not because of that. It's because I've smelt the chips outside and it's turned my stomach. So that's what happens with me if I lose a lot of weight. Don't do that again. I wouldn't do it again. I wouldn't go that far. Oh, yeah. You can still eat, Chris. What? Oh, yeah. You can still eat, Chris, can you? Oh, yeah, oh, eat, Chris. Thing you did, can happen. Um, still won't be doing so, um... I might even post a picture of me when I was really skinny. 
Yeah, yeah I'm in a black suit. Oh, that's skinny. I've been skinny than that. Oh, skinny that before that, but I did get down to around about 17 or 16 stone in weight. Oh. Yeah. It isn't. It don't sound a lot, but it was when I was. But it got me. It was because of reasons I stopped it. Not because of elf reasons. It was just. Yeah. I went for a bad time and I just took it out and I thought I'm just going to lose weight. It was just a girlfriend I went out with her telling me what to do. You fat, you ugly. Did you just say? Yeah, that's what she said when I fell out. You fat and ugly, and I gave up Chris for five years because of it. <laughs> Probably worth it for it, really. And then I lost weight on my holiday over the... I constantly just went swimming <coughs> three, four times a day. What's this going to do with Greg? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just saying, I don't think I could do... If it was six, seven years ago, I couldn't be doing this now. That's because why. I couldn't eat this. Exactly. I would have been sick on the plate. I would have to let the cake on the plate. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm going to say... That's nice. That's nice. It should... Um, one of these cakes on their own is 75p. Well, no. 80p if you want a bag. <laughs> and if you want to eat in, it's actually a pound. A pound? To oh, eat yeah, in, yeah. Tactile, so if you still want a bag, it's still going to cost you £1.5 for a, a quake. Actually, a cake. That's my mum's way of saying cakes. So if you eat this last bit of cake. You can eat it, yeah. Oh. So, i got a nice little ring, a little <coughs> goofy little <laughs> feather. Might stick it in a bowl of sweets for some kids to have and a rat trap in it. If they knock on my door, trick or treat here, yeah, have us some of these sweets at this tub. Yeah, what? I don't put my one. You make yours? I cut mine in half. Really? Yeah, I didn't eat it. Well, you said. No, I'm gonna starve. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Another ring on the boat. Yeah. I was gonna say. Uh. Probably if there was a yellow one and a pink one. Yeah. SpongeBob and Patrick. Patrick. What? Patrick. You said Patrick then. Oh, Patrick then. <laughs> well, we used to have a girl in our college called. We used to call her Patrick. Probably because of her brother who was called Patrick, but including she was a bit dopey, so that's why I named Patrick. Yeah. So I hope to see you soon. Bye. Bye.